Did you know that there are some skill difference on CBT versus official release? Let's take a closer look. Dai Luke's charge attack animation used to be the same as Razor, Noel, Chong Yoon, etc. But now his charge attack animation is the same as Bae Dao, Yula, and Dehia. Here are some side by side comparisons. Mean Guam charge attack animation in CBD is her throwing the rocks downward. While in the official release, she threw her rocks forward to attack. Here are some side by side comparison. Her normal attacks used to be enhanced when passing through the jade screen. But now, the normal attacks does not get enhanced when passing the jade screen. Here are some side-by-side -side comparison. When plunging in burst mode, Xiao could do the dash to cancel the animation to attack faster. Official release Xiao could not do that, so there's a bit of delay in his plunge. Here are some side-by-side -side comparison. Fischl's elemental burst in CBT did not summon nouns into the field. While in the official release, casting her elemental burst summons nouns into the field. Here are some side-by-side -side comparison. Crossing Kia's elemental skill has two instances of attacks in the CBD. While in the official release it become one attack. Here are some side-by-side -side comparison. Bonus round. Here are some visual changes only in CBD versus official release. Ayaka spin around in CBD while casting her elemental skill. Then these elemental burst in CBD looks like a black hole sucking all things. Globa's early appearance in CBT is a literal panda.